Taking districts. The cashola. There is something in his office. I see it. It's playboy bunny? Stack of cash. Wait, what's that stack made out of ones? What the heck? Only fifteen hundred bucks? Fifteen hundred dollars a lot of money. Like my tried true handgun, to be honest with you. Okay. Go we'll talk to Donnie Brasco here. So freaking slow. It's on the other side of the world, man. It took forever to get here. Jesus. Alright, Mr. DeMarco. What is up with you, sir? What is your jam? Other than you being a hillbilly. Vito sent me. You're Connie, right? Yup. Connie DeMarco. Been keeping an eye on the smuggling business for Vito. Roy Thibodeau's in charge now, and it's a damn shit show. Why hasn't Greco bounced him yet? Oh, he bounced Roy right into a hole if he got to say so. Greco didn't pick Roy, and that puts a target on his back. Still, Roy's trying to sell the usual shit from out of Cuba. Cigars and rum, mostly. Hell, rumor has it they even selling medicine and shit to the Cubans. Sounds like Greco's scrambling. <laughs> Imagine Greco thought his uncle Sal would give him a break, but no. So he's squeezing everyone, including Roy. Business gets any worse, Roy's gonna have to come down and see to it himself. Mind, Roy's got a few guys here and there. Might take some persuading, but I'll get him to talk. Don't have any Roy's guys yet? They're sure to talk if you, uh, ask just right. Gotta squeeze some info from the lieutenants and enforcers. Where are they at? Run! Run, Lincoln, run! I swear to God, there's an alligator in here. I'm gonna have a conniption. Like this. Oh my god! What the fuck? The sun! Get up! Fucking gators! <laughs> that just happened. <laughs> I just fed that gator. The gator just ate it. The sun. Do you know what it was? The solar flare from the sun reflecting off the river. I couldn't see the gator that was in front of us. Oh my god. Don't you worry. We got a sniper rifle. Burn on that piece of shit. We give her taking out, out the here. sentries. Her monkeys like swinging in trees. Is that true? Get out. That was a racial slur, but I'm not gonna count that one. Well, you guys don't count that one. That was just a generic comment. Bad, 
Man, this is a piece of shit. Playboy! Had to stop. Had to get it. Don't stop! Get it! Get it! Oh, these guys wouldn't have locks. Out of seven. Just instantly became night. Okay, okay. I'm in kind of fuck you up. I can use attack vest. Welcome. Coming through. Oh, here. Just watch where you're going next time. Okay, okay, just stay out of my way. Oh, it's in the weapons locker. Gimme. Where the hell do you think you're going with that? Sorry. Not sorry. Nothing personal, old man. Robbing pawn shop owners. Ah, pawn shop owners are scumbags anyways. Okay. Fabio Fab Fulci. Is he? Is the basement? Yankees out? The hell? Oh, this is different. Maybe sewer drop in here. I see stuff that can be asploded. I like. Be feet, cocksucker. It's bad timing. I couldn't do him around the corner because the other guy would have saw me. Right in the shadows. One bullet, one kill. We don't have to stay here. We can get the fuck out of Dodge. I knew grabbing the sniper was a good play. Good plays, good plays! I'll just need you up the ladder now, please. There you go. One last enforcer. Roy's guards. that shine down in Memphis. After the so-called assassinations, look what happened. America's on its way to a race war. Communists? Yeah. Fake Are you serious? We don't got time to make that call. Tell me what's going down at Roy's warehouse. The boss is trying to get medical supplies Hello. to Cuba for extra cash. I know I had a shipment in this. Yes, I know. Shut up. For me now. If there's a unit in the area, 
Hop back in, get, get out of the blue zone. Get that. Oh shit, the cops go right there. Oh no, it's not good. We're in a fucking bug. Alright, let's get in here. Attack vest? Well placed, well placed. Might not be the greatest of ideas for this mission. My girl's been questioning me lately. She thinks maybe it's time I went to confession. What, like, forgive me, Father? That sort of thing? Yeah, Darlene's all over my ass about it. Steal the seed shit. All units, search is called off. Repeat, abandon search. Return to patrol. <laughs> Go upstairs, take out that sentry. It's a lot of guys to call in shit, man. Why do the sentries all have to be the wiener guys? Thank you. Can't fire hot in the heaven. I don't even know if I need to take out all these guys. I just need the truck. I guess that'll be easier for me to take the truck if I take out all the guys. I'll probably get more money too for the medicine. Only two, three guys left. Four. Well, those guys are standing together. I'm gonna go back down. Easier to steal this thing. There's no one around. We need to get this ship out of here. Don't feel right. Well, it's not like the law is gonna catch us running TVs or some shit. No, uh, they're just gonna catch us running medicine. Medicine we stole from a goddamn charity. Not only that, we're selling to them res in goddamn Cuba. Now you get a conscience. There you go. Wow, he's not dead yet. <laughs> he was just phased. <laughs> that guy was built for tough, man. Holy shit. Oh, I like my gun. Without a rando crowbar. There we go. One more. I think up top. No. 
take this. Ah, Father James! I haven't seen you in forever, bro. Keep that open, though. Unless I can ram this fence. Maybe. There you go. Man, this thing's slow. Oh, it's so far away. Okay, let's see. Alright, Father James. Don't ask where the money or the drugs came from, just take it. Why did you put the green thing there if you want me to park the med truck there? Beep. What's this? Medical supplies, antibiotics, bandages, bunch of other stuff. Thought you could put it to good use. I probably don't want to know where this came from. Don't ask and I won't have to tell you. Fair enough. I know some folks who can use this. I'll take it from here. Connie DeMarco. Back here again to the shanty town of a town. They don't come from the exact same place as me and do half the work I do at that bike. I shook all those guys down. Anybody follow you? Boy, it's rattled. Scared of Greco. Terrified of you. <laughs> Heard he started sleeping at the warehouse. It's the only place he feels safe. Good. Means I have an easier time getting my hands on him. Once he's taken care of, we'll move in. Vita will turn things around. You'll see. Roy Thibault. It's not that far. I'll still take a car, though. I'll still take a car, though. Fire run. Pop bullets in there. He's got a gun! <sighs> That's what you get for trying to be a good Samaritan. Bullet in the back. Alright, warehouse. Holy shit, that's a lot of guys. See, I can call in dudes to help me out, but if I call in dudes, they're gonna get awfully loud. What's the over under on Greco getting rid of Mr. Thibodeau? It's good odds if we keep losing money and merchandise like we've been. Roy don't have the balls for this kind of wake. Old boy's a paper pusher. No twist from him. 
I see our staircase right there. Maybe I should just... Huh? No. Spider one, boys! Shoot that stupid bastard! Yeah. Alright. Guess we're doing this. Like this. You. You badass. Just get to the phone. I see the world in my horizon. I see. There you are. Snatch and grab. Let's see what this spider one, boys. I can make things good again for you, Roy. Join my crew. Great. That sounds great. Whatever you say. See? Things are already looking up. Bound rocket secured. It's all you, Vito. Need you guys to secure the smuggling operation at the warehouse. I'll send them over. And Lincoln, just because Greg goes a dipshit doesn't mean he's a pushover. He'll probably send out some of his men, have him try and take you out. So watch your ass. Get your hands on Greco and rough him up all you want, but don't kill him. That's for me. Hmm. Haven't heard any end bombs drop for a while. Have you guys? I don't think I have. I was in the third platoon company C of the 614 tank destroyer battalion during World War II. I trained as a medic, but I still carried a gun. Every man in our company was black. The army didn't know what to do with us other than they didn't want us fighting with the white men. Glenbach. Klimbach was that little French town up there near the border with Germany, and we were ordered to take it. Now, the Krauts took out three of the four anti-tank guns we had, but there was no way in hell we were letting them get the better of us. We were determined to show we was just as good, if not better, than every other soldier in the service. I, I don't like talking about medals I got over there. Only way a man survives something like that is through the grace of God. Doesn't seem right celebrating a little piece of tin. No one knows I helped Lincoln except for you and John Donovan. Not that I'm keeping a secret, mind you. Just that nobody ever came around and asked about it. 